A smiling Molly Skaggs looks like any other player on her school's volleyball team. I love the, I love spiking. And I love to serve. I love bumping. I love everything. But it's that second, third, and maybe even fourth glance that her family knows all too well. It was a shock when she was born, but you know, God doesn't make mistakes. Molly was born without feet but now has prosthetic legs. She's had the legs shortly after her first birthday. Her prosthetics have become so much a part of her life. The other day I came up with this. I called myself the transformer because one minute I'm like this tall, then I just put on and I'm like that tall. <laughs> and so I do the whole transformers activate. She's already influencing others. I never thought I'd be an inspiration to anyone really. When I started volleyball, I, I did it just for fun and everything because I really wanted to be in a sport and I'd always wanted to do volleyball. But when people started recognizing it, it made me feel really good about myself. And I never really thought about, you know, inspiring anyone. She's always been determined and, and never really let it bother her. You know, if she wants to do it, she would do it. And because of her condition, Molly feels like it's made her the person she is today. I feel like I'd be snobby in my feet, really. <laughs> They'd have to go through a lot more challenges with prosthetics, but I mean, I'm blessed. In Elliott County, Brandon Smith, 13 News, working for you.